Hey everyone, Deadbine here. Welcome back to Sky Vault, episode 148 here. We're two away from the big 150. Um, yeah, we have set up a few new farms. We're going to show off the botany pot reorganization as well as do some auto traders for villagers to get apples. It's going to be a good episode. Okay, here we are. So, we redistributed. We were like maxed out on the things that were growing there. Just redistributed some stuff that was a little bit low. One of each mushroom. Got the crimson going. Again, I don't know if you need crimson and the whatever the, the teal one is. Um, so, yeah. These take forever to grow. So, we're getting those redistributed. In. Getting some vines going. Um, sweet berry or glow berries we only have like 3,000 of. And then these we only have like 7,000 of. Again, our other forms are faster, but this is just... I don't have to think about it, which is really nice. Really, really nice. So, the next big thing, though, is... Um, auto traders. For villagers. So, they're actually fairly cheap. Like, they're really not expensive at all. So, we're going to grab... I don't know. I can make actual stacks of this. With the carbon that we have. Um... I don't even think we need 10, but I'm going to make 10 traders. Because we, we can also use these just to make our, our village more convenient. Like manual trading, I mean. But let's just do this. Um, I think... I think we're going to make four. I think we're going to make four. And we're going to do three apples and one for saddles. And then maybe switch the saddles to apples after. So, but this is how we're going to do it. We're going to go modular routers. Because always. Um, yes. And then we need a sender. I think the hopper should be able to keep up with this. I actually don't know. Hmm. Because it do, I don't think the distribute. We're going to make a distributed modular. Module. But I actually don't know if they'll be able to keep up the, the other way. All right. Let's just get them fed with it first. And then we'll go from there. So let's head back to our home. Old home. A little blast from the past here. We haven't we haven't been here in a while. Well, I have been, but just to grab apples, but that's about it. So, for those who are tuning into this first episode, this is, was our old base, villager converter, all that kind of stuff. Okay, so we're gonna grab. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Let's just grab three of these guys. Apparently, you can attempt to murder with your Archon. Got it. Be careful with that. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, we should do a name tag. We should do a name tag one for sure. Okay, so maybe we're doing two apples and a name tag. That actually might be worthwhile. We'll start with that. Dang it, I can't believe we did <laughs> almost murder something there. I think I think the actual ceiling protected them, funny enough. Yeah, you need saddles for your uh for your thing here. Uh where where are my saddles being held? I'm gonna need more. I'm gonna let's max that out upgrades wise. Oh, I don't want to use diamonds. So let's actually max it out with these then. Yeah, I don't want to use diamonds right now. Okay, good. Well, we should definitely have those in there with it. Hmm. All right, anyway, I'm getting distracted here. So what we're going to do is uh, let's grab some cables. We're going to grab this. Um, I don't think I'm going to need speed upgrades, but we'll see. And I think I am going to put this right down below here. I don't know if they... 
put into that? I don't, I don't know how fast they are. Let's, let's make a few hoppers. Anyway. But we might be just pulling these out with a modular router at some point. But either way, we're going to put them here. Okay, so then you just place the villagers in. And they're nice and happy. And you can select what trade you want to do, which is going to be this. This. Okay. And then you. And then you. Okay. So... Uh, let's just put a router. Oh, I guess it's just so I can see them. Interesting. Get, get a distributor module, uh, which is currently on round robin. Yep. Transfer out of router. Yep. Okay. And then we're going to do that. And that should keep them fed with emeralds. Which will in turn trade for them. I guess the question then, I guess I guess what would one modular router with enough pulling upgrades be worthwhile? Or like could a hopper theoretically keep up with this? Because that's a lot of items. But they they so here's the thing. They don't I think hoppers will be able to keep up with them because they don't. Um... Oh, you know what? Let's use a flesh chest for this because it's kind of cool. They don't. Uh... They can't barter all the time. They they still follow the rules of villagers. They still follow those rules of villagers. So, like, I think they'll be totally fine with that. We'll see, though. We'll see if they get backed up here. I mean, if anything, the hoppers will have a bit of a buffer on them. Oh, shoot. <laughs> we don't want that. We want saddles, please. And the other thing I could do, I guess, is... Also, why am I using this chest? If we're going to use a chest here... Did I... Did I unlock it? Oh, no, that's my... <laughs> I got this confused. The other thing. Where, yeah. I thought I had an ender chest viable for this. That, that's the other playthrough we're doing there, Dead Pine. Other oh, playthrough. Let's get these pants out, because they're causing problems there. We need to get a speed upgrade on both of these things. Get that vault ready to go there. Okay, speed upgrade. Um, speed and or stack upgrade. Do I have more of these? Let's get these going. And let's make one speed upgrade. I'm not really too worried about more. Yeah, we could we could do could do drawers. That actually would be kind of interesting. I don't know. I don't think these guys auto input into chests. But there, I mean, the real test here is the real test here is like during during the course of a full day, can this keep up? That's really the test, right? But you could do drawers. That could be interesting. You think definitely not? Well, they, they only trade twice per day, Amir. So I don't know. I, I don't know if that's correct. You know? Like, it's caught up completely right now. Um, all right, let's, I guess I do need a stack upgrade and all that kind of stuff for these guys. 
Hmm. Where's something I can borrow from here? <laughs> I don't know where all my good speed upgrades are. No, no, no. This, these are gonna get put. In, these are gonna get put into my drawer system. They're not going into the chest. The chest is just a buffer to export them into my system. Uh, let's make sure we get these guys cooked. Uh, let's get it. Let's get a second temporary chest there for all of our villagers. That we could potentially put in there. Okay. Uh, yeah, I really need... Basically this. And, and this, and the speed up, or this... Well, let's just put out speed upgrades in here now. I mean, I can also just fill them up manually, I suppose, as well. And that can just keep it fed. It's probably the easier solution. And the, these, you know, these ones only need more. Oops. All right, then I just need to import this. And that's actually kind of truly where we need the... Uh, Speed and stack upgrades. Uh, sorry, we need an importer. Have that already. Beautiful. It's rare that we do automation these days of any amount. This will need a stack upgrade as well. Let me just do this. Help that help them along a little bit. And that, that'll be another one where I don't think this needs much more than what we have here. We could do it. We could do a router for that, but like, why bother when you have? It's totally fine. And that is working there. Love to see that. So the question is, yeah, this will be able to keep up with the amount that's coming through. I think we'll be good. I think we're good here. I, if we add more, this may not be able to keep up. But... I think, like, starting from zero here during a full day of worth of trading, I think we'll be fine. So let's, let's sleep and make sure they get their reset. Turn off to not waste emeralds. Um... Uh, that's nah, alright. We have literally free emeralds from our eye spawner. We really are at that stage of the game where everything's just kind of free. We just gotta turn on the right farm. Okay, but that should that should take care of our apple problem. Theoretically. And we just gotta keep an eye on this to make sure it's not getting overloaded too easily. We can even, we can even, once we get enough saddles, we can definitely replace this guy. The saddles fill up. This will get filled up and then these will get backed up and that's fine. Or rather, they'll go into my storage system, which we've got, you know, 120,000 items left. Okay, good stuff. Um, I'm going to get prepped up, ready for this vault. And we're going to hop in, random vault, and we're going to try and do that. We're always a little fun doing some automation there, but yeah, we've... Apples have been a problem for a while now. They should not be anymore. Um, after this vault's done, like during a day's worth of trading, we should get several hundred apples every day from now until we're done this series, which is really cool. So good stuff. See you for the vault. All right. Now that the 14 minutes of automation is done, <laughs> let's go vaulting. Let's do the thing. Nice little random vault here. See what we get. Nice scavenger to treasure. Which is pretty good. Scavenger means I'm going to put this here. Um, what is treasure again? 50% rarity. Nice. Southern facing vault. I actually quite like this theme. Um, and how does this one look? It looks possible if we can get those wizard wands. 
and we have to loot a heckin' lot of uh, wooden chests. This is difficult enough where I think I am going to... Uh, I think I am going to hold off on the first room and just start looting the second room. Why do I still take damage on that? Oh, I don't have Stone of Jordan anymore, chat. It's not guaranteed. It's not guaranteed anymore. Oh, also, this is not guaranteed anymore either. Look at this. We're not hitting... There we go. That poison effect. Fascinating. Extreme dungeon there. As I missed stuff. The four dungeons again? Ah, uh, Honestly, we just need an ornate dungeon. Or to get lucky in these. Oh, and I gotta activate Archon. Just let me love you. Oh, wow, we have so much mana now. Oh, I didn't even realize how much mana we had here. Holy smokes. Just watch them all burn. That's not gonna get old, man. That is not gonna get old. Uh... Swap that there. Saddlebags, good, but oh, hello. Don't you dare destroy my key. That guy hurt a little bit. Did that one already. Need no dang pottery shards. Of course, I've got a spider web. I don't think I need anything from those. Need diamonds, honestly. Teepees. Alright. Let's go check out this dungeon. We got here ornates. I mean, it is ornates. Okay. Ultimate cheese here. These guys really hurt. You can feel the extreme on those ones. Okay. There's one wand. Holy smokes. He's doing it. For some reason, they don't open this door. I don't know why. So I think this works. I can't, I, it feels like they're getting, oh, it's a champion mob. Okay, that's why. Oh, man. Just watching the mana bar go burr all the way down is highly amusing. Highly, highly amusing. Holy smokes, dude. <laughs> we definitely want mana back with our... Uh, with our thing here. That is so silly. to be 
touched by you. That was very scary. Still is very scary. my thunderstorm back. It's the only thing that does enough damage to that. But then we'll have the, uh, you know, we'll have the dungeon for free there. I say free. Certainly cheesed a little bit. But. Pretty classic dead pine. Mm, all right. Cool. Metaphor, if not for spending, I know, right? Hey, are you still here? I can't tell. I'm doing two hearts. These are doing 515 a hit, by the way. That's how much health this thing has. You dead? You're dead, okay. That's how much health that thing has, which is wild. Like, that's that's absurd. Alright. That's a sack. Oh, was that not the boss? Was that just a random... Let me grab this in case we need to leave. Just give me a full rare set, why don't you? What the heck, dude? No, that was the boss. Okay. This is the boss room here. We're not going to get our second wizard wand from here, are we? It's not, it's not feeling like it. Bummer. I feel like I missed an area, but I don't think I did. All right, well, I guess we got one. Did I miss one? What the heck one did I miss? If I didn't need a wizard wand, I wouldn't be going back. But we need a wizard wand. Basement. It's in the boss room. Ah. Well, chat, you're all banned because it wasn't a wizard wand. What was the point? I don't know. I'm going to pause. I got to ban chat real quick. <laughs> Fine. Stay around this time. Worth a shot. Alright, uh, yeah, let's keep going south. That was a really good starter room. Yeah, I do wish I had, like... Oh, I don't know. I do need these. I do wish I had, like, three more hearts to work with. Or, like, two more hearts to work with, even. For the 15. There's one. There's two. Nice. Nice. Ooh, and a dungeon. Let's go. Oh. All right. Round two. Getting a little cheesy. Oh, maybe they updated the spacing on this? They might have updated the spacing on this, it feels like. All right, well, let's go loot the rest of the room here. Uh, we need Lightning Storm for this. Let's go Let's go check upstairs. Oh, 
Don't die. Don't die? I'm trying not to, man. I really don't want to. There we go. Gets you all infected as well. Um, NM Crazy, holy smokes, that's another tier 3 sub for something for 22 today. NM, thank you so much. We have a lot of tier 3 subs, and I really appreciate it. That's It's such an epic way to say it. Like, it's way, way above and beyond. And I really appreciate the 15 months. I've returned with my bagel and I have been banned. Uh, sorry, Judge JLo. I, you know. Ooh, that was a little bit of echo. Deal. Only two, but it's better than zero. I'll take that. But yeah, chat, uh, chat's been failing me, you know. And unfortunately, you're part of chat. It's just it's how it goes. Also, out of curiosity, what kind of bagel? I'm not a huge bagel aficionado, but I do, I do enjoy a good bagel. Two greater than zero, exactly. Everything with locks and cream cheese? Oh, great bagel. Depends on the place's locks, of course. Sometimes I feel like you don't get the best locks in certain places, but really good one. You like playing with cream cheese? That's actually that's actually underrated, I feel like. A plain bagel with just cream cheese has a lot going for it. I'm not really sure what my go-to I have. As a kid, it was always a blueberry bagel with um, cream cheese. But that depends. now it depends on like if I'm in the mood for fruit or not. Um, so, yeah, I don't know what my go-to is anymore. If I'm being honest. Uh, Smite Archon and Storm Arrow are the two OP things. Yeah. Smite Archon is... I have enough mana regen where it can be active 24-7. Um, and that's the one that, when I get close to a mob, hurts them. And then... The Storm Arrow is a long cooldown. It does way more damage, but that's, like, what I'm doing using to kill these bosses. And like these guys. These guys kind of hurt, though. But it's all based on um, ability power. So I have pretty high IP AP as well. So like this is this is a very... I built this. This only exists because I put a ton of gold and time and effort into these. So. Lucky it's nice. My storm arrow's back. I'm going to put that down so we can kill the boss. Nice. And then we should be home free. Uh, here you go, Shah. This is what you're looking for. Modifier Archive. You right-click it. That's pretty good. Being able to get attack damage on uh, legs. Definitely good. Man, I've gotten so many saddlebags. I just need a wand. Just need that. Wow, dang, another saddlebag, dude. If we, if we don't get... Our second wand, be I think we did just fail on getting our second wand here, because I'm pretty sure we're done. Yeah. Dang. I was going to say, if we don't get a wand from this one, it's unlikely that we finish this vault. That's okay, though. Okay. Keep going south here. I really just want to find rooms now, too. Like, we've been finding dungeons. I just, I need it. I need, I have four keys. Almost a 50-50 shot of it having the appropriate key here, you know?
Not what I meant to hit, but that's okay. And because I need Vault Diamonds, we're probably going to have a good chance of getting the 200 plus here because I'm more likely to go for Wooden Chests with that. Which is always funny to me. movement is not very good right now. Where are my doors at? Bummer. Oh, uh, yeah. Keep going south here. Watch be an Escalium door when you find one? Probably. What are the trinkets on my build? Are you spellbooking or using a mana trinket? I am using um, both. Or not both, rather. I'm using um, the pedal and Flactory. The pedal keeps me topped up on health, so sorcery kicks in most of the time. Um, and that's really the kind of the cool thing about my build. So I have like 80% from sorcery. And then um, the phylactery is giving us a 50%. We're in, we're in like the 500% range. Mana regen wise. Which is really kind of what you... Like I, I, I could not... I don't think I could do this without either of those. I, I might be wrong on that though. Like we might be able to get rid of the pedal. Like, might. Because having the Stone Jordan would be pretty good. That said, I just, I haven't found a need to have my abilities have plus one level. I just haven't. It just doesn't feel necessary to me. So... I use Feather Spellbook um, with Nova and Fireball. Built them, but I'm a bit of a glass cannon. Mm. What did, I don't know. What, which one's Spellbook? What does Spellbook do? I don't think I have that. I really do want to try Triple Jump at some point. But the thing with Triple Jump is... I think Triple Jump's going to be better for like my attack damage thing. Because... I don't really... like. I need to, I need to be near mobs for this one with the Archon. Oh, 50% more ability power. Yeah, that's pretty good. All my, all my my ability power is very high, though, without that. Like, I don't really need the extra ability power. Um, My armor is taking care of that for me. Oh, it's percent ability power. Sorry. Plus 50%. I thought it was a straight 50. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. But th with that, like, I feel like... I mean, my storm, my storm arrow does 515 damage a hit. It's absurd, you know. But I, yeah, I guess. Oh, that, I teach their own. I love the idea of triple jump. The thing with triple jump is, I'm probably gonna have to. Um... Oops, I'm gonna have to. I want to use it for maybe, like, well, we do have it now. We could go back and try the Hero's Landing build with the triple jump. That would be kind of fun. Um, but I think triple jump's good for getting around individual rooms, and I have to use normal dash with it. While um, I think I'd rather have frog for almost every other scenario.
Which right here is letting if I get the fall damage reduction trinket. Uh, yeah, fair, fair. It does still reduce the damage if you upgrade it all the way. It still does reduce your damage like to almost to zero. There's a lot of pylons in this room. Holy smokes! I can feel the lag with that one. Did you get left out? I don't know. I think it's going to depend a lot on what armors I get. As well, you know, what legendary what legendary modifiers I get. Hey, Kevlar Giraffe. Still one of the best names out there. Really appreciate the, uh, the, uh, the Prime for three months. Thank you, thank you. We're one away from another set of fireworks. You'll love to see that. A little bit of everything room. I think. Oh, maybe it's just wood and wood, gold, and uh, ores. We have eight minutes here. How, when did that happen? Having too much fun, chat. Having too much fun. Just got myself porcelain aardvark, which is based on the concrete donkey from. Uh... Thank you, Cam. Cool. Yeah, that's fan. That's fantastic. I don't, I don't know the type of material and then name of animal. I think actually works really well for a name. I don't know. It just gets me. Never really played worms. I know some people were really into that. Played the uh, the tanks. That was a that was like similar but a little different. I think. So I'm gonna get my wand here and then realize I haven't been looting enough. Uh... Oh, never mind. I was gonna say, oh, hello. Can I hug you? Thank you. Realized I didn't loot enough uh, wooden chests for the for the paper. Good morning, Sam. Like, how are you today? Why won't you love me? Let's do a check here. Yeah, sixteen. We got the two. I only have five um, blood vials as well. It is always a punny day. Dead no, Pine, did you know that General Zod's first name is in fact Neil? I know it's his first name because when he introduces himself, he says, Neil before Zod. I mean, I get the pun. I don't, I don't understand the reference and that's okay. But I understood the pun. Unfortunately. I'm going to go west and north. Start heading back. Superman villain? Yeah, I'm not... Not into comics, not into... All that stuff. I like the Marvel adaptations. I like the Spider-Man movies. Yeah. That's, that's, a, that's the extent of my superhero and all that stuff. Gotcha. I didn't. I have. I have seen some of the DC movies, but I they did not hold my interest. I think the original Wonder Woman was like the only one that was like actually pretty good. I saw copiously in there. That's nice. No, I, I, I understood it, Cam. Here is one you should get. Why are mathematicians the worst people to date? Because they give way too much respect to their ex. It's fair. Just because, just because a you know, 
didn't know where the reference came from. It doesn't mean I didn't understand the pun. The pun was fine. But I know you just want to chuckle. Realistically. I will take any excuse for another pun. I mean, that's fair. That's fair. Where are the doors, chat? Where are the doors? Because I don't know. I don't know where they are. Snide, how are you today? Cheers. Thanks for being here. Oh, here's next, Marks. Also, Game Call, I do really appreciate those bits. As always. Support in the stream. And all we do here. Hey, let's go. It's funny how, like, uneventful these are compared to what they used to be. Because of dungeons. <laughs> you beat one impossible dungeon and the chests you loot in there just go for days. And days. And days, comparatively. There's our stupid wizard one, huh? I guess we should see how close we are. We're, I, well, no. We know how close we are. It's... I don't, we're just not going to be able to get enough rip pages in time. Yeah. It's nine more rip pages and a blood vial. That's just not happening in two minutes, 12 seconds. So, yeah, we could, we could I guess, push for it, but... I don't really want to use a lemon. Or it's not a lemon. I don't really want to use an orange, which I think we'd have to use for this. So. Not going to bother. Okay. Let's go east. Oh, definitely not impossible, but yeah. Just not worth the resources spent, I think. Because we don't really need gear right now. We don't. Uh, we need gold a little bit, but we don't need the stuff. We don't need the stuff that comes from... Um, we don't need the stuff that comes from that. I will happily eat some lemons for a door here. Those guys still hurt. Uh, yeah, we're out of here. I'd rather run. An I'd rather run another vault. Yeah, the coin. Yeah, if it was just wooden chests, maybe I would consider it. But the fact that we needed coins too. Um, 187 chests. There you go. There you go. Nice. That was a good solid vault. Let's see if that loot. We actually spilled over even our new bags worth of stuff. Like, this was entirely filled with gear. That's kind of silly. Unless I... You know what, though? I actually... Um, there's a chance I put it in wrong as well. There's also that chance. Let's just, again, I'm going to put everything that's in our bag here until we run out of space. And we're not going to worry about it. Hoping once we get a repeat dungeon that we'll have... Uh, or, you know, one of, the, one of these days I want this bag to like come out with like basically nothing in it, which would be kind of cool. All right. 
Okay, how did we do here? Six gold straight up is pretty good from the few coin piles that we missed. Oh, yeah, there was a lot of gear. <laughs> uh, so much gear. Got those two echo pieces, too, which is nice. I wonder if we should be soul smelting these guys down. Like, uh, we can just make copper with, the, like... There's a chance I should be, uh... Doing that, because I don't feel like we're going to use them in this playthrough. When we get in... Well, like, when I'm in the building phase of things, I might do that, but, yeah. Uh, Alright, we'll do hashtag... Scrappy. There's enough gear here to do these... Like so... We've been saying, hey, we're not going to, we're basically not going to use these things, but honestly, we've been getting, our gear turnover has been pretty high. Basically, I'm going to save all the epics. I don't actually know. Doesn't look like we have any new. Um, prefixes here. Was any good? Not particularly. Oh, there's a legendary quantity. Okay. Um, let me get another chest here. I, I, I don't want to have to actually go all the way down. This is this is a classic dead pie move here. And we'll, we'll transfer those down periodically, but this, this way I don't have to worry about it. And we'll just do that. Okay. Hashtag common. No worries, Snide. I, I appreciate you being here today. Oh. That's a lot of common pieces. Um, all right. Let me just let me just go through and look for legendaries. Before I even look at anything else. Okay. It's fine. Fine, not good. Uh, if I did this, it actually helps a lot. Ooh, that's a good one. Uh, that that one goes into this guy, and if we get a void vault, we put that on. Uh, maybe I should make that better than it is, I guess. But that one seems good to me. This is fifteen percent. Oh, did we get a new resistance level? here maybe we did so we do have a new resistance prefix okay that's good to know at 82 because then we maybe you know maybe like something like this so leggings we could do better I mean this is 18% that does make this worse this chest plate worse because like we can get 2% less than this as just a roll. So, going to be keeping an eye out for those. Hashtag rare. So much geared. Well, we also got to check the... Oops. We also got to check our... Um, paladin leggings. Okay, those are still the same things as well. Okay, so maybe I am keeping Mega Dig. Armors that are like high enough here. Because then we can roll them into things with resistance. I did not mean to do that, but that's okay. And also maybe we're just not worrying about that either. Okay, Paladin Leggings, huh? Dang, that's pretty good rolls too. 
definitely make those work. Oh, that's just regular Archon, though. Oh, man. I wanted that to be Archon Smite. Oh, no. That is it. That is it. Oh. That's plus two level to that. With decent resistance and decent mana regen. I guess it's not decent resistance. It's okay resistance. Okay. Come on. 16%. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Many were needing to simplify them. Oh, is that the case? Gotcha. No more colons in the name. That makes sense. Okay, so this chess play again will now be missing some armor, which is a big deal. So we'll have to get this to have armor because this one doesn't have armor, right? Yeah. So basically, we have to make these two equate to these two. Okay, and I need cooldown reduction on that. Or I would like to have cooldown reduction on that. I mean, we can craft 11%, which is pretty good. Yeah, we also have to, we also have to implicit that as well. Um... We need ability power. I wonder if we make a uh, wooden cascading vault just to, just to get plating, <laughs> just to get plating. All right, let's uh, let's go ahead and make some fundamentals. Oh, oh yeah, I guess I could have shift clicked. Okay. Such a low roll in the ability power. Okay, that's actually not terrible. So this one will need... It'll be a little bit less mana, but that's okay. So we need... Um... Ability power on this one. Ah, see, that's this is already like better armor plus that. I don't even know. Um, no. pretty good that's pretty good i want to mess with the numbers here for a second hold on let's check our pants here so this one gives us 74 we, we need resistance on this though yeah all right fair maybe i'm maybe i'm crafting these with resistance Or mana regen in mind. Uh, I don't know why I'm going to here. Let's try resistance first. Oh, there's also mana regeneration here as well, which is pretty important. there uh let's do these 
Okay. I really don't. Oh, the plus one level to Stonefall is not the worst, though. It's not ideal. I'd rather have health and armor. It's really good mana regen, though. <laughs> okay. That's perfect. How much mana regen can we craft on that, I guess? 40%. God, we need to hit one of these. I mean... Yeah, we go down quite a bit there. Our mana regen has been pretty good, though. And I guess I can't craft two things on there. But what if we did this and then just hope to hit the other one? Um. <laughs> uh, it's like the worst of them. God, so bad. And then this one would have to be re rolled fundamentally for ability power. I don't know, Chad. I don't know. Because this 36% mana buff is also very good as well. What if we kept these pants? So it gives us the armor back, though. We really need that. Because remember, we're losing armor on this one for the Archon. Oh, and I need cooldown on these. I need a decent cooldown on this. We can craft. Yeah. So that's 3% less cooldown, but that's okay. I really want to try this plus one level to Archon. I just, I can't help but feeling like this is like just off. What? Oh. We're still 93%. Yeah, our ability power suffers a ton there. That's minus 100 ability power. That's just... Oh, no, no. Uh, right, this had to come back. Okay. So it's minus 40 ability power. So we definitely need to get ability power on one of these. How much mana do we have with this, though? Basically the same as we did before. Because of that 36%. So but I don't think we... We need over 100, but we don't need that much over 100, if that makes any sense. So, um, yeah. Hmm. What's up, Morgana? I'm probably not going to do a restart on, on patch 13. Not for this series anyway. Um, but that said, I might do a, another s s playthrough. Not as a, not as a, you know, curated series like this one is, but uh, maybe as like a VOD channel thing, because I have the VOD channel at VOD Pine where I just upload my Twitch VODs. Um, that might be there, but yeah. Um, but maybe I don't know. I've, if there's an overwhelming number of you in the comments of this episode that say, "Patch 13, please restart," um, I would be open to the idea. I just. I feel somewhat committed to this world, and I don't want to do that unless there's like at least twenty to twenty to fifty comments saying, "Hey, we need to," you know, "I want you to restart," you know. Oh man, I feel like we're so close on this. I don't know. That's tough.
Because the other thing I could do is uh, re-roll this one to try to get the ability power there. Because what does this give us? That one gives us 94% because of all this resistance we get. And our build, But our ability power is still suffering there. How much mana do we have from this? 217? Let's maybe do it that way. I really like the idea of this plus one level to Archon, but do we need the plus one level to Archon? It's hard to say. No, you cannot go to the end in Sky Vaults. It's so close. Okay, I think I'd be, I think I'd be willing to sacrifice that. Oh, we lose cooldown reduction though. You know what we could do with this one? We could do the suffix recrafting there. That's probably worthwhile. We're still 94, 191 there. Yeah, okay, good. Let's do let's do that. Let's do the suffix. Uh and see if we can't get lucky. It's better. Way, way, way better. I don't think there's anything... Suffix-wise, there's nothing really better than... I guess it's... Yeah, suffix-wise, there's nothing really better than quantity, rarity, and mana regen, right? I don't actually really know. Oh, it's cooldown reduction. Right, cooldown reduction. Oh, so maybe I should have crafted cooldown reduction on that. That was my mistake. But I guess we wouldn't have gotten the mana regen there, right? So what, is it, what does this put our cooldown reduction at? 39%? That's still pretty good. Because, we're, we're, again, we're really not spamming stuff too, too much. I think I like this. I think I like the replacing of the pants. I think I like that. And then maybe we reset that one later for the Archon. I think this is where we're gonna be at. I don't know. I I have a lot of options here. That's a short. That's a short and long of it. We have a lot of options here, um, and I just don't quite know. I do also feel like with a level eighty-two helmet, we could do pretty well. Hey yo, that's seventy-five percent of our daily sub goal. You'll have to see that with clap. Dominize 109 month resub. Longest resub possible. Those are all manual resubs. Dominai, thank you so very much. Thank you, thank you. So this has this is a level 82, right? So I don't know I, what what's the what's the cap on resistance? I don't really know. And what are we looking for in a helmet? One in three? Hmm. Nice value. Somebody said something about 100. Somebody said something about 100. 100 months from Value Town. Cheers. It is day one. 109 is day one. My goodness. Sounds good, Shaw. We'll catch you then. Thank you so much, both of you. All right. So, I can't craft super high resistance on this. I don't even know if I want to, though. Maybe we crap. We need, we want some cooldown, or we need some cooldown. Area of effect is nice too. But then, health and armor would be a big deal. That's a really high ability power as well. 
Well, that's a pretty tall, tall order there, I think. I do think we get this going, though. And then hope to get lucky there. The mana regen's stupid high, which is why I want it. But also, it, um, like, we'll see. Maybe we get lucky, right? That's not bad. And then the eight armor back. So we lose some resistance, but we've gained that back, kind of. So we lose the three hearts there. What's our defensive stat now? St back to 93. Um, funny enough, with the even the percent increase, we're actually better off with... It's like basically the same thing with the, with the 35 versus the 21. That's kind of funny. But we'll see what we can do with these. All right, make a stack of pogs real quick because we can. Let's get 32 of these going. And let's just see what we can do here. I am crushing our plating. Greed. I don't think I can be greedy with that. 35 is still pretty high. And that gives us 210. Yeah, that's got to be the call. That's got to be the play there, I think. Plus more regen than we had before, I think. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, those are two major upgrades. We are going to be looking for level 82 armor, I think. I think that's actually pretty sick. I'm going to put this in here. It, there's going to come a day where I need to come in here and get rid of a bunch of the level 81 and below. But right now, yeah, I think we're on the eye for... Because the, uh, the implicits are higher, you know? The implicits are just higher for certain key things. Um, Got to get those enchanted, of course. But uh, I'm pretty happy that. Still at 93% defense. I like the amount of hearts we have. It's not super low. It's not super high. Um, we're going to do a ton more damage with our ability powers. Um, our cooldown reduction is a little bit lower. Not by much, though. It's 10% lower. No, that's rarity. <laughs> it's 12% lower. <laughs> um, but still pretty good, right? Like That's still pretty good, you know? And then, yeah, we have a little bit more quantity quality, but we're also just doing more damage. Good stuff. Uh, Lizard Breath, thank you so much for subbing for six months during this hype train or starting a hype train. You love to see that. DJ, cheers. Lizard, cheers. Thank you so much. That's a good segue into YouTube. Thank you so much for coming over, sharing your primes, sharing your subs here. Uh, it really supports the cast so very much, just like these fine folks who started a pro, uh, <clears throat> hype train. And uh, yeah. We'll catch you for the next episode. Um, might do like a wooden cascading wooden vault. Might give that a shot. Uh, might do a gilded run. We might just run random vaults. Honestly, random vaults are pretty good to just get some stuff going. Um, JB, thank you very much for the 150 bits. Appreciate you. And uh, yeah, YouTube, thanks for tuning in. Watching these all the way through. Really appreciate those who do that as well. Subbing to the channel is a big deal. That helps a lot. But seriously, just watching all the way through. Sharing this with a friend who might like some mod of Minecraft. In particular, my style of mod of Minecraft is also a great way to help the channel out. Um, but of course, always be respectful and all that good stuff. So anyway, catch you next episode. Bye-bye.